All right, everyone. So today I'm going to compare the differences in boot times between Tiger and Leopard. Now there's been discussion out there that Leopard is still slower to boot compared to Tiger. I'm going to see if that's true or not. Um, I'm going to try and make this as scientific as possible, but there are going to be variations between the startup. Unfortunately, I don't feel like wiping out or imaging my drive, so I am going to physically swap hard drives between the MacBook. Um, so in here right now, I have a Toshiba 120 gigabyte 5400 RPM hard drive. It's partitioned into two partitions, so I have 60 gigabytes allocated to Leopard and 60 gigabytes on my storage partition. This right here is my stock Apple hard drive. It's a 5400 RPM momentous 60 gigabyte. Um, it only has one operating or one partition on it. So there might be a little bit of a difference here. But the main thing is that the rotational speed is the same. So that is one thing I do have control over is at least the rotational speed between hard drives are identical or should be at least. And the way I'm going to do this is I'm going to use the uh, stopwatch on my iPod. And normally the uh, menu bar is the very last thing to be loaded. So I'm going to wait until I see a full menu bar coming across the screen. And that's when I'm going to hit the stop button on my iPod. And of course I'm going to try and hit the, uh, the power button and the start button simultaneously. Alright, so let's begin.